Mic check, check. 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 Hey, check. 30 minutes, this place is going to be crazy with ventriloquists. All right. Hey, welcome everybody to the 31st Ben Haven Convention. What do you think of that? A lot of times the events are really isolated. Like, hey, I'm the only event in my town and they don't have anybody to talk to. So here, they get to talk to people. Those cards to the ride, it's gonna be great. Shut up, where's my cards? I think I'm going all in. Actually, quite a few ventriloquists who started out initially were quite shy and are still shy, and that's not an uncommon trait among ventriloquists. I came to my first convention and I, I just fell in love with the people. Everyone's so friendly and everybody is like me, talk to themselves and play with dolls for a living. <laughs> Hey Charlie, I'm running late to the show, but I do need you to help fix my dummy that his ankle's fallen off and I need little tiny nails. I work full time as a ventriloquist. I did 482 shows last year. I do the school assemblies throughout the school year, and on the weekends I do different shows with birth and. I actually got my start in this Ohio pageant and I was top five and I got to do my ventriloquist act. She really loved it. I thought it would kind of end. As she got older, <laughs> just he meant settle down and get married. Yeah, and have kids and instead of her puppet children. <laughs> she just. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Dan Horn and Orson. When you're a kid, you don't think about whether you're good or bad. You just do because it's fun. Little Gary, say hello. Hi. I saw your mouth move. Oh, uh, hi. <laughs> and I was beat up a lot for being a sissy, but I didn't care. I liked it. <laughs> My name is Dylan Burdett, and I hopefully will be the next best ventriloquist. He's been interested in it since, since he was five, so I can't ever remember a time when he wasn't playing with puppets. I get along with most of my dummies, and my dummies don't seem to get along with each other, so. I don't quite understand why Dylan picked a black uh, figure to use. Reggie, I think, I guess he considers himself a pimp. <laughs> the number one element to being a successful ventriloquist is you have to be funny to be good. I can't walk very fast. I don't want to lay an egg. Pretty much the rest of the family wants nothing to do with us. And they, they always try to tell me to stay away from my aunt also, but I was in rough times and my aunt was the only one to help me out, so. I can say things through the characters that I, if I said it myself, I'd be fired, I'd be slapped in the face or beat up. But they can say stuff and get away with it. I'm going down to get drunk. Actually, it's a God-given talent. The Lord was leading me into full-time evangelism, ventriloquism. Riding along on a carousel, trying to catch up to you. Everybody, beware of the puppet mobile. Horses chasing, cause they're racing. So near, so far. On the carousel. I have a picture of him dressed up as Zorro and me as Catherine Zeta Jones. <laughs> 